Welcome to lesson five. We're going to do some fun stuff in this lesson. But before we start with um, new stuff, let's play the flower song. And we're going to do something different with that too. So um, let's play it four times in a row without stopping. And the first two times, I'm going to play the melody along with you to um, help you along. But then the last two times, I want you to keep going on the melody. I'm going to play harmony along with you. Okay? So bow on the E string. Ready? Go. should have been fun for you. Um, Alright, so now we're going to work on new things. So, um, first new thing we're going to learn is a D lizard, which you may have already attempted on your own, who knows, but it's the same thing as our E lizard and our A lizard, but we're going to do it on the D string. So, let's just set the bow on the E string, and just set your fingers on the E string. Don't play. Then, let me back up here a little bit. Then let's put everything on the A string. So tilt the bow and your fingers. So um, I want to show you something with my elbows. On the E string, both of them like this, and then A string level, D string level, G string. You see how both elbows are moving? This, the left elbow comes around the violin so my fingers can reach, and my right elbow comes up a little bit so that my bow is on the right level for the right string. You don't want your elbow up too high or collapsed, but just level for that string. And this arm needs to be around, because if it's not, then it's hard for my fingers to reach and it's going to make me start clenching. So then to come down, my elbows, the, um, my right elbow is going to lower and my left elbow is going to go back around, kind of, until we get back to E string level. So let's start on the E string and move our elbows to the A string and then to the D string. Got that? So now let's play our D lizard. I'm going to tap the fingers a little bit and get them ready. We're going to start our open D with Huckleberry Pancake. Ready, go. First finger. Second finger. Third finger. Repeat the third finger. idea. And then the next thing we're going to work on is I'm going to teach you an A major scale. So an A major scale is an A lizard and an E lizard put together. So we're going to do we're going to play an A lizard and we're going to add an E lizard to it and it'll make a scale. So we're going to go really slow and I'll tell you what each note to play. We're going to play each note Huckleberry Pancake and we'll go slow so you know what to do. So we're going to start on the open A string with the fingers hovering so they're ready. So, ready, go. First finger. Second finger. Third finger. Now tilt the bow to the E string. First finger. Second finger. Third finger. Down the E lizard, um, 
I mean, you really take the time between this open E and the jump to all three fingers on the A string, because that's going to be important when we start working on twinkle. Make sure you really take the time to tilt your bow and let all of your fingers find their places, because that's something new for them, for all three, to just have to land and then continue for us to finish that scale. That's a real tricky part, so make sure you really take your time and stop and move everything. Give yourself as much time as you need for your bow to find the A string and all, all three fingers to come down and then play. So really take the time there and that will help you out a lot later on. Good job!